Ever thought you were too old to chase your dreams? Well, Fauja Singh, a British Sikh marathon runner with Indian roots, totally smashes that idea. He kicks off his running journey at 89 years young, an age when most people are chilling. But wait, there's more. He doesn't just start jogging. He bulldozes through world records, becoming a hero for tons of folks out there. Now, I bet you're itching to know what's the magic behind his extraordinary journey. Stick around because we're about to uncover his secret sauce. Fauja Singh, the legend himself, was born on April 1st, 1911 in Bays Pind, Jalandhar, Punjab during the era of British India. Being the youngest among a farming family of four, his early years were marked by challenges. But here's the twist, Fauja Singh didn't start walking until he was five years old. His legs were thin and weak, so going on long walks was a bit of a challenge. As he grew up, he became a farmer to support his family. Then in 1992, after his wife Jeanne Carr passed away in Jalandhar, he moved to East London with his son. New beginnings, you know? After his fifth son, Kuldip, passed away in August 1994, something clicked in Fauja Singh. It wasn't until 1995 that he got back into jogging. With his wife's demise in 1992 and his eldest daughter's passing due to childbirth complications, he decided to give running a shot. Not for trophies, but to deal with his grief. So he laced up his shoes and started with some gentle jogs. But here's the kicker. Fauja Singh didn't really start running a lot until 2000 when he was a huge 89 years old. Yep, you heard me right. He made a big impression by taking on the London Marathon that year. And guess what? It was his very first time running a full marathon. Now that's what I call an entrance. He finished it in 6 hours and 54 minutes, beating the previous record for people over 90 by a whole 58 minutes. After that, Fauja Singh became a real running sensation. He zoomed through marathons in New York, Toronto, and even Mumbai. He had his personal trainer, Harmander Singh, right there with him, keeping him on track all the way. So you can see, once Fauja Singh hit that running path, there was no stopping him. Stepping up his game, Fauja Singh took things to a new level when he conquered the 2003 Toronto Waterfront Marathon in a personal best of 5 hours and 40 minutes. Known as the Turban Tornado, he not only excelled in sports, but also used marathons to raise funds for charities and showcase Sikh culture worldwide. In 2011, at 100 years old, Fauja Singh achieved eight world age group records in a single day at the Ontario Masters Association Fauja Singh Invitational Meet in Toronto, Canada. His remarkable timings were officially recorded. 100 meters in 23.14 seconds, 200 meters in 52.23 seconds, 400 meters in 2 minutes 13.48 seconds, 800 meters in 5 minutes 32.18 seconds, 1500 meters in 11 minutes 27.81 seconds, 1 mile in 11 minutes 53.45 seconds, 3000 meters in 24 minutes 52.47 seconds, and 5000 meters in 49 minutes 57.39 seconds. This feat reset 5 world records for his age group, all achieved within a single day. For the other three records, there were no previous benchmarks because no one had ever dared to attempt them at his age. Interestingly, some of his achievements surpassed the existing records in the 95-year-old age category. Just three days later, on October 16, 2011, Fauja Singh achieved an incredible milestone by becoming the first centenarian to conquer a marathon, securing his title as the oldest marathoner. He successfully completed the Toronto Waterfront Marathon in 8 hours, 11 minutes, and 6 seconds. However, there's a little twist to the timing. Since he took more than 14 minutes to cross the starting line after the race began, the officially recorded time for the age group was adjusted to 8 hours, 25 minutes, and 17 seconds. This achievement did indeed set a world record, but despite his remarkable feat, the Guinness World Records declined to recognize it. The reason? Fauja Singh couldn't produce his birth certificate, 
mainly because official birth records weren't maintained in India back in 1911. His passport proudly displays an April 1, 1911 birth date, and to top it off, the legendary marathon runner received a personal letter of congratulations from Queen Elizabeth II on his 100th birthday. And get this, Fauja Singh carried the Olympic torch for the London 2012 Olympics, truly embodying the spirit of the event. Remarkably, he hung up his competitive shoes at the ripe age of 101, following his final long-distance race in Hong Kong where he completed a 10-kilometer run in 1 hour, 32 minutes, and 28 seconds. Fauja Singh, a living legend, shattered the idea that dreams expire with age. Starting his running journey at 89 when most relaxed, he surged through records, an inspiration to all. His story transcends running, teaching that new beginnings have no age limit. Beginning running in his mid-80s, he showcased that success thrives in the right mindset. Singh's life isn't aloof about athletics. He's a prime testament to never giving up and assuming a resting resilience. But his bequest extends more. Using his fame, he advocates causes for a better world, education, poverty, seniors' well-being, he championed them all. His popularity wasn't limited to the show. He meant it to inspire love, unite people, and foster togetherness in times of crisis. Fauja Singh isn't concerned about his track record, he's about making a statement. His account proves that age and restrictions can't stop us from accomplishing our dreams. His activity shows that through active work, resolve, and an absolute mindset, we can achieve anything. He taught us the principles of persistence like back activity presents hurdles. Before we move forward, make sure you're all set. Hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you won't miss a single moment of Fauja Singh's incredible journey and his secrets of health and fitness at the age of 112. More artlessly effective readers globally, Fauja Singh's campaign was immortalized oral in the pages of Fauja Singh Keeps On. Crafted by Simranjit Singh, this book narrates the aberrant ascendance of Fauja Singh to the ranks of marathon running greatness. The book traces his adventure from Punjab, India, and his adolescence apparent by hardship, including the partition and claimed losses. But Fauja Singh held on to hope, emerging stronger. His love for activity sparked amidst adversity, and the book dives into his acceleration to all-around fame, the aberrant capacity of the affectionate account, and giving back. A beacon of youthfulness, Fauja Singh has shared his secret. No ego, no greed. He donates his balance or earnings to charity, and this, he believes, fuels his vitality. As for the talks of a biopic, he humbly declined, reasoning that his achievements are already known and celebrated. He's unyielding in his authenticity. When asked to swap his turban for a different head covering during marathons, he stood his ground. This pride in his Sikh identity led to a surge in turban wearers, even in sports. What wisdom does he share for health and longevity? Simple yet profound, eat in moderation and exercise regularly. He's never used a walking stick despite his age, crediting his vitality to sensible living. His eyesight and hearing may have faded, but his physical health remains excellent. Fauja Singh isn't just a runner. He's an embodiment of endurance, discipline, and hope. His journey transcends sport, touching lives and proving that with unwavering determination, we can create our own legacy. Don't let this inspiring story slip away. Tap that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay connected for more incredible content ahead.